to celebrate our 100th episode. We're very lucky. This is like crazy. <laughs> When I look back of you know where we started and how young we were, it flew by, but they do say when you're having fun, time flies. It's been great to see the kids come up as they have. I love to tease Montana because his voice was so little. Hello, George is speaking. <laughs> One likes to think, I haven't aged that much and all this time, and then you see children go from here to here, and it's like, oh, well, maybe, maybe time has passed. Perhaps this is a good time for a physics joke. It isn't. Something Missy's done over and over, like a hundred times, is roll her eyes. The knock that Sheldon has. Meemaw. Missy. Georgie, he's probably made out with a hundred different girls. He's done that about a hundred times. I'm totally fine with that. It really does feel like a family. I mean, bonded very quickly. Like, it was sort of instantaneous that we all just sort of snapped together like a puzzle. <laughs> As weird as it sounds, like love at first sight. All my family is in the South, and so I don't have any family members out here. But I kind of do because of the show. And so I love it whenever they do a dinner scene. It's always like so playful and like funny, and everyone's laughing. You all right? Well, she's had a whole beer, so who knows? Mother, can we just pray? We have such an amazing and loyal fan base because of Big Bang, but also now in our own right, because we've been going for five seasons, and people have started to really enjoy the show just for us. Every family can relate to the show. People tune in so they can see themselves. It has a broad appeal because of uh, the stories we follow with all of these different age groups in this family. And I think to be able to come home at the end of the day and watch a funny show that's just real and genuine and silly is really great.